Welcome to the protocol video on how to use Invitrogen Ready Label Antibody Labeling Kits. These kits are an excellent choice for researchers conducting multiplex experiments, providing purified labeled antibodies with the flexibility of primary antibody detection, all without compromising brightness and stability. The Ready Label Antibody Labeling Kits are available in both 20 microgram and 100 microgram kits, and today we will be going over the protocol for the 20 microgram kit. The Ready Label Antibody Labeling Kit comes with Ready Label Spin Columns, Ready Label Wash Buffer, Dimethyl Sulfoxide, Ready Label Labeling Buffer, Ready Label Neutralization Buffer, pH 3.3 Ready Label Elution Buffer, pH 2.0 Ready Label Elution Buffer, and five vials of reactive dye. You'll also need your antibody solution or cell culture supernatant, a benchtop centrifuge capable of up to 1,000 Gs, two milliliter micro centrifuge tubes, pipetters, and disposable pipette tips. The first step is to prepare the spin column. Twist to remove the bottom plug of the column. Loosen the cap, but do not fully remove it. Place the column in a collection tube and centrifuge at 1000 Gs for 30 seconds to remove the storage buffer. Discard the flow through. Next, add 100 microliters wash buffer to the column and centrifuge again at 1000 Gs for 30 seconds. Discard the flow through. The second step is to purify and label the antibody. Load 20 micrograms of antibody solution onto the washed resin in the column. Centrifuge at 200 Gs for five minutes or until no liquid remains. Dissolve the reactive dye in DMSO by adding two microliters of DMSO to a vial of lyophilized dye and pipette it gently. Next, dilute the dissolved dye with 18 microliters of labeling buffer. Immediately add 15 microliters of the diluted dye onto the resin. Centrifuge at 200 Gs for five minutes and discard the flow through. Incubate the column at room temperature, protected from light, for 30 minutes. The third step is to elute the labeled antibody. Add 100 microliters of wash buffer to the column, centrifuge at 1000 Gs for 30 seconds, and repeat. Then add 15 microliters of neutralization buffer to a clean 1.5 milliliter centrifuge tube. and transfer the washed column. Add 60 microliters of elution buffer, pH 3.3, to the resin. Centrifuge at 300 Gs for three minutes and collect the eluted antibody. If a poor yield is achieved, use the pH 2.0 elution buffer. By following the simple protocol we've demonstrated today, you can efficiently label antibodies for your multiplex or spatial biology experiments.